How's it going everybody? Texas Man here. I hope you guys are all having a great day. Please give this video a thumbs up if you guys really enjoy it. Subscribe if you guys haven't already. And if you guys have subscribed, thank you guys for doing so, so much. Also, make sure to hit the bell notification button and select all for all notifications so you guys don't miss out on future videos or streams here on my channel. Also, make sure to head over to Twitch and follow me there at Douglas447. I stream there at least once a week, whether it be for Call of Duty, Battlefield, Star Wars games, Halo, Destiny, or anything else you guys suggest. And if you guys have any movies you guys want me to watch and review here on my channel, whether they be on Blu-ray, digital outlets like Google, or on Disney+, Plus, please let me know in the comment section and I'll get to watching and reviewing those for you guys as soon as possible. And as always, we're going to be talking about positives and negatives and talking about a film that came out in 2020 titled Soul. This is one of the newest Disney Pixar movies. And uh, I do want to let you guys know that I will be talking about spoilers. So if you guys haven't seen the movie yet, uh, I want to let you guys know for a fact that I will be talking about spoilers. So this is your spoiler warning. So... First of all, I really wasn't all that excited to watch this movie. The trailers didn't impress me. I was like, okay, yay, it's another Disney Pixar film. I mean, I'm going to watch it, but I just had no excitement. I wasn't hyped at all to watch this film at all. And um, I was blown away. Uh, this was better than I expected. And I really encourage you guys to watch this movie. Uh, I was constantly laughing throughout this film, has a lot of humorous moments, and it's got a lot of heart, it's got a lot of Wally and up moral-like themes. Um, this film really hits home on a lot of morals and themes and lessons, especially like the fact that, you know, we learn in this film, again, in our own lives, that people all have passion and everybody in life has a purpose. Uh, the morals in this film are just extremely deep. The whole, you know, chase your dreams is in this movie. Make something meaningful in life is in this movie. Watch this movie, guys. You guys will not be disappointed. This is a great comedy family film with some fantasy and musical elements. There's no, like, musical numbers in this film. Like, say, for Frozen or, you know, Cinderella or something like that. Uh, this is better than Onward that we had in 2020 by 100%. Uh, I enjoyed the fact that this film decided to dive into exploring more, exploring a lot more of the great before, a place where souls learn personalities, quirks, and interests before entering the human world. Uh, the, the jazz scores in this film, I personally love jazz really enjoyed jazz and the jazz scores in this movie were great and uh, I found the stairway to the great beyond really cool disturbing and scary all at once like you know you're just you're entering this like electrical white orb and it's just gonna shock you it's really cool and disturbing at the same time uh, the celebrities greatest hits moments was really cool uh, this film also goes after the fact that make sure you spend every minute like it's your last and then at the very end, this film really hits home on this moral of that life has both good and bad moments in it. And life is made up of those moments. And both the good and the bad moments in life, they all matter. They're, they're all important. And they help shape you into who you are and who you're going to be in the future. Also, can we just talk about the fact that the soul swapping was really funny where, you know, the person that wants to get back into his body ends up going inside of a cat. <laughs> I really like that. Uh, this film has a really fabulous ending. I highly encourage you guys to check this movie out. Uh, for negatives, there are a few I do want to discuss. First of all, this is a Disney Plus exclusive. Uh, I do think it is worth getting a least one month subscription just so you can watch the movie. There are some places and times that you can actually get a one month free trial. So if that's the case, I encourage you guys to at least check this movie out once and get the one month subscription just so you can watch the movie and then cancel your subscription. It is definitely worth it. It is really worth it. Um, for a lot of people, this film won't be as good as The Incredibles, Coco, or Inside Out. But for me, it was better because this movie was more of a character piece and 
it wasn't focused on big explosions. It wasn't focused on action. It was about, no pun intended, the human soul. Uh, another negative, it takes about over half of the runtime for the main plot, the themes, and the messages really to start to shine through. This movie is about 90 minutes long. So the first half is a lot of build up and set up and just getting you exposed to this new world. And I feel like they did a good job on the setup, but I kind of probably wanted an extra 15, 20 minutes towards the end. So it would have been a lot more impactful and a lot more breathing room. Like there are times where you're like, okay, there's so much happening. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be focusing on at the moment. And then lastly for negatives, you're not sure where Soul 22, the main soul sidekick, goes to Earth and what does she end up doing. Like I know there's a lot of theories and fan fiction out there. Um, I'm just kind of curious if they're going to do a sequel to this and explain like where did she go and kind of things like that. But overall guys, I had a blast watching Soul from 2020. If you guys haven't had a chance to, I highly encourage you guys to do so. Whether you get your own one month subscription for Disney Plus or you go over to someone else's house that has it, you'll enjoy this film. With that, I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. I hope you guys all have a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys in the next video or stream. Bye, guys.